Hello beautiful beings, in this video I'm going to talk about the joy of continuous growth in all areas of your life, the expansion. You're always expanding, no matter what you do, that's a good news. <laughs> but then I will we'll go into the subject um, conscious, continual growth, liking to see how your intellect is expanding, liking to see and enjoying to see how your physical body is growing, how your relationship is evolving and getting deeper. And you can expand in so and so many ways in your life. And there's a, I would say, in us humans, <laughs> we're all different, yes, but there's some fundamental like basics we all seem to share. There's a thirst or a hunger or at least a passion for growth and expansion. That's also one of the reasons why we came here to our planet, to explore, to live, to experience the physical life and the limitation. So as, for example, our intellect in this 3D body is quite limited in comparison to our soul, <laughs> and the perspectives and possibilities that arise with our soul perspective. So, um, one of those joys... Oh, dear mosquito! <laughs> so, um, the brightest perspective is um, so big that coming into a body is so interesting to experience all those things and learn math or... Okay, many of those people and especially me in the past I wasn't so such a friend with math but right now I'm really enjoying it to learn all those things <laughs> and have a completely new perspective about it and also to see where it brings you from a, I would say a spiritual medium state in that mind space and how nice it is to switch those states they're always interjoined and when some important message come you are always going to be notified but actually to move around all those states the medium state the um, relaxing state and this really energetic passionate somewhat tense but in a nice positive way intellectual state and just just grow in all those subjects I always see those subjects as a opportunity to grow not as a burden put on yourself especially when you're through high school or when you're going to university or you're being in elementary school I don't know where you're at and some people just have a or get a wrong perception because in the way it's introduced to them like ah oh, yeah you have to do this you don't have to do anything basically but it's so interesting enough itself when you have somebody who is explaining it to you and if you don't have somebody who is explaining those subjects so much to you just ask friends and put yourself out in the internet hey who wants to do some math physical German or I don't know English or Japanese Chinese whatever and do them with people you resonate with who are good at the subjects and who like them that's my my um primer advice there because you're not only connecting energetically and you're having this good chemistry and fun in the group but you're also learning those things so much quicker you can cipher like I don't know like <laughs> it would take five or ten times longer to do it on your own when you're just in this nice group of a few people or just with a friend it can go so fast and then you see how much pleasure actually you get out of it and you have all those like um, I would say old conditioned nice reward impulses from your body like ah oh, yeah I made this oh yeah I just won this ah yeah this was right I got the right answer here and there and then you have those nice experiences which accumulate each other and which create a uh, I would say a bliss bubble which is nice not like a bubble that can pop easily but it's really really nice so on that note I would say always go for your quests in all directions don't stop being curious. You can also learn in meditation a lot of experimental feeling states. But I would say also have a look on those intellectual subjects, especially in our society. They are really, really rewarded. And if you have some kind of decrease, people also tend to <laughs> take you more serious <laughs> rather than when you just have a camera and you talk about stuff. See, people always like a form about certain things. There are huge benefits in getting degrees. And I would say, if I can talk about myself, I would just go for education while doing my, my things in life. So always listen to your intuition also on that one. On that note, I wish you a very beautiful day or week or weekend. <laughs> no, basically it's a very beautiful week. I was just joking and I love you very much as always. Namaste.